Hello everyone, I am Dr. Godhinder Raman. In this section, we are going to discuss with normal distribution problem. Look at this problem. If x is normally distributed and the mean x is 12 and the standard deviation 4. Find out the following. Probability of x greater than or equal to 20. And the next question, probability of 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 12. In this problem, given mean the value x mean x 12 and standard deviation so mean x is nothing but mu notation mu mean x mu 12 and standard deviation sigma 4 it's given now any problems x range is given the question is find the probability of 0 to some range or some interval x variable but here normal table this normal table is it variable in is it variable so directly any type of range we can take from this table answer is available in the particular normal table but variable is is it variable our main intention is the x variable convert into is it variable then we can use the range from the table therefore how to convert is it is nothing but x minus mu by sigma this is the conversion form the first question probability of x greater than or equal to 20 so what is the mean that probability of x greater than or equal to 20 so we can convert this x variable into z variable how to convert both side subtract mu therefore x minus mu greater than or equal to 20 minus mu so both side to subtract mu then divide by sigma both side so no value changes subtracting mu divide sigma on both side therefore now x minus mu by sigma value is nothing but is it greater than or equal to 20 minus mu value given 12 sigma 4 therefore this is nothing but is it greater than or equal to 8 by 4 is it greater than or equal to 2 so what is the mean that this is a bell shaped curve bell shaped curve this bell shaped curve minus infinity to plus infinity and then zero now the question is from 2 to infinity suppose I consider here 2 2 to infinity so 2 to infinity means to calculate this range this is our range from 2 to infinity for this total probability 1 so left hand side 0.5 the whole left hand side 0.5 then right hand side 0.5 now 2 to infinity difficult to calculate from the table then how to solve this <coughs> right hand side 0.5 therefore this range is nothing but 0 to 2 the whole entire range is nothing but 0 0.5 right hand side full 0 0.5 therefore 0 0.5 minus of the range 0 to 2 minus of the range 0 to 2 now from the table from normal table c 0 to 2 this is a normal table in this normal table where 0 here 0 where 2 here 2 the value this is the intersection 0 to 2 value 0 0.4772 
zero point five minus zero point four seven seven two. The answer is zero point zero two two eight. And what is the next question? Zero to twelve. Probability of zero to twelve. As usual, subtract mu on both side. And divide by sigma. All the side. Now substitute mu value. Twelve sigma four. Then this x minus mu by sigma is z. Then twelve minus twelve by four. What is the value? Of this minus twelve by four minus three less than or equal to z less than or equal to zero. Now this bell shaped curve. This is a bell shaped curve. This curve. Satisfying symmetric properties. So left hand side point five, right hand side point five. Symmetric property satisfied. So what is a symmetric property? Suppose minus three here. This is a range. This is a minus three. So this area. Negative side zero to negative side. So what is the mean symmetric? Same right hand sides are equal. Zero to three, zero to minus three is negative side. Same symmetric is nothing but right hand side same side same area. It's equal. This is a symmetric. Symmetric, we should write zero to three, negative zero to minus three to write in the form of zero to three because of symmetric. Now zero to three is that variable. Now see the table. In the table, zero here. Zero. And uh, this is a zero, zero to three. This is a three. Four nine eight seven. Four nine zero point four nine eight seven. So this is a value using normal distribution. Thank you.